And it's time for the most biased sports report in the history of Winnipeg Radio. Canada looking for their gold medal right now, taking on Team U.S. America at the World Juniors. Earlier today, Sweden, Sweden, Hamad, Switzerland to win the bronze medal. I believe the final was 11 to 4. Should I do? <laughs> I have come from Switzerland, yes. I come for fourth place. I bring cheese and chocolate. I don't know if that's how they talk over there. Cheese and chocolate, though, that's what they specialize in. Former coach of the Habs, Bruins, and Leafs, Pat Burns, says he's good friends with one of the officers who was dispatched to the home of Tiger Woods the night of the, quote, accident. The officer told his good uh, friend Burns, who told a Montreal radio station that Aline, the wife, hit Tiger in the face with a nine iron, and that's the reason why he's in hiding, because she knocked out two of his teeth and gave him a cut across the cheek, okay? So it was a direct hit. And that was the cause of the crash into the tree. I guess she was chasing to finish him off. <laughs> that's when he hit the tree, and she's like, oh my God, I got to call 911. He was trying to get away. Uh, then apparently Tiger, this is according to Burns and his uh, cop friend, then Tiger was flown to Phoenix with his agent on a private jet to get his face fixed. And that's why he wasn't around to talk to Highway Patrol. See, it's all coming together thanks to Pat Burns. By the way, the mistress watch was at 18 at last check. Sunshine Girl, Katrin, is a rerun. She's a replay. We've seen her before, so let's not waste time here. Uh, ESPN is launching ESPN 3D this, this June, just in time for the World Cup of Soccer Football. You can see Argentina fan uh, getting shanked by a Spain soccer fan in 3D during a random soccer hooligan riot. So <laughs> that'll be exciting. ESPN 3D coming to uh, uh, an HGTV near you. Uh, the company behind luring an NFL team back to Los Angeles says the two likely teams to relocate are the Jacksonville Jaguars and the Buffalo Bills. Both are considered to be small market teams as far as the NFL is concerned. And the company also says that teams like the Niners, Vikings, and Chargers won't be pegged for relocation because they are seeking new stadium plans of their own. L.A., I, I, they're really trying to get an NFL team. And if you need another reason to dislike the Summer Olympics, here's one. Australian Olympic hurdler Jana Rawlinson has reversed her boob enhancement because it was having a negative effect on her training. She says with her new chest, she'll leave the competition flat. Was that good? <laughs> this guy thinks so. Hey. That's all I got for you.